work with? Who would I like to work with? Um, it's funny because some, some of the people that I, that I would have liked to work with um, four years ago, I'm working with now. I'm working with now. But um, if I had to say from right now who I'd like to work with, um, I guess we can tie that in with who our influences are. You know, there's people like Ryan Leslie, who's, who's a big you know, hip hop and R&B producer. There's, um, you know, there's just so many people that I could tell you I'd, I'd like to work with for you know, a number of reasons. Because if I'm telling you I want to work with them, then for obvious reasons, they're already established in the industry. <laughs> so, do you still have a lot to learn, or do you? Uh... Oh yeah, I mean, you never, you never stop learning. The minute, the minute you, you the, the minute you think you don't have a lot to learn, then I mean, you just drop out of the race, and there's, there's no point in it. But it's um, as far as what we do, we're experts at what we do. I mean, we're we're very proficient in everything we need to be, you know, everything we need to be doing. But as far as learning, you know, tips and tricks and whatnot, we're always, you know, every day we we find something sure. new that we could have been doing, you know. So. Yeah. I guess the, uh, uh, where can clients find your information? Or do you have a website? Or? Oh, sure, sure, sure. We have, um, we have a website. It's um, www.azpmultimedia.com. Um, we also have a, we have, a, we have people running these websites. We have that. We have our main website. We have uh, a MySpace, which is um, the MySpace.com. It's forward slash AZPNJ. You can find AZP on Facebook. It's it's all over the place. I mean, it's advertisement. You know? Of course, any of any of our viewers that are, are wanting this information, just simply uh, contact st our studios, and we'll be more than happy to give it to you. Zach, right. are you a musician, a designer, a writer yourself, or are you just into the business aspect of it? Uh well, you know what? I, I started out as a um, as a musician and um, somebody with a lot of creative thoughts, and you know, now I find myself really, really caught up in handling. Um, handling the business aspect of it because I mean you, you have to dedicate yourself because if you do something you have to dedicate yourself to it unfortunately it's it's it, sometimes I do feel it like really really draining me you know the the the, the business and whatnot but until the day I die I'll be a musician um, you know and, and this, you know singer songwriter but it's uh, even though I have my own guys handling like the photography and the graphic designs and the, you know artworks and all this crazy stuff on clothing it's it's you know. It's something that you know. I'm always in the same room, just standing there watching them. Like, oh, sure. you know, there's not, you know, just you know, kind of creative directing it a little bit because yeah, I'm, I'm into all of it, man. That's why I do this, you know. It's all for it. Well, you know, before we before we did the show, you know, we always do a little bit of background on the people that we're going to have on, and it, and one of the things that stuck out to me that that's been said about you time and time again is that you're a natural, <laughs> you're a natural talent, uh, and you're a natural in the business. This is this is where you should be. Do you consider right. yourself that? Um. You know what? I really, I really don't think that uh, my 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 personal opinion on philosophy is. I don't think that you could be a natural in anything from the day you're born. I think that when when you're born, it's like you grow up, and based off of what you grow up around, you find different outlets. And if the situation that you grew up in, and the circumstances, and you know when you mix it with like you know your 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 mentalities. If you find a certain outlet and you pick the right outlet and, and you really stick with it and you put your passion and talents into it, then that's when you become a natural. That's when you really become a natural at it. So do I think I should be where I am? Oh, yeah, I, I could not see myself doing anything else. And what the amazing part we find is that you're 17 years old. Do you feel like you're 17? Do you feel like you've lived a lifetime already? <laughs> I feel like I'm 30. 30 I feel like old. I'm 30. I just turned 17 and I feel like I'm 30 years old because uh, it's, it's, you know, you don't, you don't sleep. You know, sleep. You're dealing with people, you know, decades older than you sometimes. You know, and and it's they don't look at that. They don't look at that. as much as much as it's really a uh, it's a topic. People always say, "Oh, you're just 17." Like really, the thing is, is yeah, when you're not dealing with business, people look at you. Oh, wow, you know, you're 17. But really, when 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 you're doing business with people, it's they don't care how old you are. It's like they want to see results. They want to see numbers. They want to see your 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 work ethic, where you're coming from. They want to see your base you're on and you know, it doesn't. If you, you know, if, if if you know, one of the one of the world's you know um, largest successful entrepreneurs and CEOs started his business at 12 years old, and he he was named the Entrepreneur of the Year at uh, at the age of 19. You know, and it's just that goes to show you that it doesn't. You know, age is a number. It's it just means how long you've been here on Earth. You know, some people experience more things than others. You know. I guess the biggest question is that everybody wants to know is, is where does Zach Hanna and ACB ACP Productions see themselves in 10 years? Well, um, in 10 years, uh, uh, see that's 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 a long span. See, we we uh, we you know our, our our fiscal year starts every every 12 months. We do you know 12 month sale forecast and everything, but we go by every three years. 
I mean, as far as, you know, in 10 years, we should be <laughs> well established. You know, we look at 10 years, we say we should be there already. You know, we, sh we should be settling down. We should have wife and kids. Multi-million you know? dollar client. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's in 10 like years. That. That's in 10 sure. years. But we go by every three years. I'd say in three years, we should, you know, in three years, we should uh, we should at least be, you know, a period where more people can see us, you know, and uh, doing the right kind of work and hopefully make a respectable name for ourselves through our work. I mean, you can, you can hear it. You can hear it. I mean, it's just a matter of getting it out there, you know. Folks, this is Zach Hanna. CEO of AZB Productions. Zach, thanks for this inaugural interview no, for yeah, the hot seat. Yeah, my pleasure. On 2 Alive News HD. And we're going to, uh, I mean, us definitely and all our viewers are going to be looking to seeing your work in the future. And all right. Thanks a lot yeah, for being on. My pleasure. My pleasure. In the hot seat with Vinny Lowe. Thank you.